Holy Spirit, come and have your way. Anoint my lips to speak, God. Lord, let every ear hear the word of the Lord. Let every eye see what you are doing, God. There is no one like you, Lord. And Holy Spirit, I just invite you to come and do whatever you want to do on this video. Speak whatever you want to speak in Jesus' mighty name. So today, I have something burning on my heart and I want to share it with you it is a word of the Lord just to encourage you and this is what the Lord is doing so if this hits you in the heart and it resonates with you just know that God is speaking to you okay because he loves you so what what am I going to say what is the Lord going to say as I was opening up my curtains in my bedroom. This is this is how the Lord works with me. He'll speak to me through ordinary things and ordinary actions. Because if you are looking for the spectacular in God, sometimes you're going to miss it because it's that still small voice that wants to speak to you through the mundane things, okay? But are you paying attention to God? Because He's always speaking. So my curtains were closed and I was like, I want some... I want some light. I want to see outside. Okay. So what do I need to do? I need to open up my curtains and open up the blinds so that I can see. I can see and light is pouring into my bedroom. So listen up as I tell you what God said to me. As I was getting up and pulling open the curtains, God said, I am giving the people fresh vision for where their vision has been shut up like curtains over the supernatural portal of their eyes. God is drawing back those curtains in this season of your life so that He can give you fresh vision. Your vision is about to change. You're not going to see what the world it has on display. You're going to see what God says, okay? You're going to be given heavenly vision. You know, the Bible says without vision, the people perish. We must have a supernatural eyesight change, okay? We're, we're getting a new perception, that new heavenly perception. We're getting new lenses put on. As God draws back that curtain, the light is going to shine through to places and spaces that you needed to have fresh vision in, and God's going to illuminate it with His light, and you will be able to see clearly. Then you write the vision, you make it plain so those that read it can run with it. It is time for new vision, says the Lord. So position your heart as He pulls back those curtains and restores your vision where the enemy has come in and tried to darken so you can't see the goodness of God. I'm telling you, God is, we're just breaking off those scales off your eyes right now in Jesus name. And I just speak clarity over your vision in Jesus mighty name. And maybe some of you have in the past been able to see into the spiritual realm and see the angels and see all the goodness of God and the ways that he speaks through nature and all that and see both sides demonic and angelic and um, be able to discern and the enemy has come in and shut down that gift I just break that off of you right now those scales off your eyes right now in Jesus name and I say restoration of supernatural vision right now in Jesus mighty name so, as you turn your eyes to Jesus, even your natural eyes to Jesus, God is going to pull back the veil and you're going to see the mysteries. You're going to see things that God wants to show you. You're going to see Jesus. And it is it is so that you can get closer to God and that you could be a voice to say what God is doing in this hour. You can be a voice of hope. So, I hope this encourages you. It's time for fresh vision says the Lord and if you receive that fresh vision say I receive it in the comments and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already as I release more encouraging and prophetic words so God bless you don't forget to type amen and subscribe and I'll see you next time